What's up, YouTube? This is your girl, Comatic Medium Prophetess, and I'm back with another video. If you're new to my channel, I am a prophetic tarot reader. I do not read cards based off the meanings. I read cards based off what spirit tells me, the holy angels, and the divine. I am also a psychic medium. I am able to connect with those who have crossed over. Um, what else? I have small children, so sometimes I may stop in the middle of a reading, but it won't be long. Just a couple seconds or a minute or two to check on my babies. Um, I'm also, um, I also come on here where I do like prophetic messages, where I talk about the government, preferably the end times, love, life, relationships, whatever God puts on my heart, mind, body, and soul. I want to do a reading. Um, let's see what your person wants to tell you. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Archangel Michael, Archangel Raziel. Archangel Raphael, I ask you to sing your greatest white light. What does your person want to say to you? Spirit is telling me to use my homemade deck. What does this person want to say to my collective? What does this person want to say? What's going to come out? Karmic. Ooh, somebody could be dealing with a karmic. Look, drama, drama, drama. Somebody, ooh, some, look, controlling. Somebody could be dealing with a karmic that's full of drama, that's motherfucking controlling. This person could be an Aquarius. This person's name could start with an H. Howard, Hannah, I don't know. Someone is an actor. Someone is fake in this situation. Understanding. I'm hearing this song by uh, Escape. What I need from you is understanding. How can we communicate when you don't hear what I say? Yeah, so this person, whoever this karmic is, this person is very fucking controlling. And they don't understand shit. This person is fake as hell. So I'm saying that this person could be very materialistic. This could be, You could be dealing with a Taurus or an Aquarius. And this is a sad situation. Anything else, Spirit, before I pull some tarot? Whoever this is, you love this person. And this karmic may love you, but you guys just may not be too good for each other. Now, i just seen military two times. So, you could be dealing with somebody in the military karma. So, oh, karma. So, this is karma. So, okay. What I'm hearing is, is that you could be dealing with a karmic. Or somebody, I don't know, collective... You could be a person that was dealing with a karmic that, and this karmic left you for another karmic, and this is their karma. And their karma is, is they're having to deal with a fake ass bitch or a fake ass nigga that's fake as fuck, act, act, act a certain way. I'm hearing keeping up with the Joneses may act a certain way, this, that, and the third. This person is full of fucking drama that they left you for. This person is controlling as fuck. They, these two people love each other or you loved this person in the past take it how it resonates this person lacks very much understanding so this person this could have been a karmic to you that left you for a karmic or ghosted you take it how it resonates whoever they left you for lacks understanding this is a sad situa situation because this person misses you they want to come back towards you like I said you could be dealing with a Taurus or an Aquarius but I'm feeling that this karmic that they left you for could be someone that's of younger age or something like that. Does not have to be age or somebody that could lack maturity. Somebody that's just very immature. Somebody that acts their shoe size, not their age. And this karmic that left you for a karmic could have met this other karmic on a dating site. Anything else out of this? Ooh, I've seen children. Yeah, so this person, you, you and this person could have had children together or I'm saying secret pregnancy. So somebody could have gotten a karmic pregnant. Anything else out of this? Evil eye. Ooh. Yeah. So some so so this could be a karmic couple that's fucking y'all my damn head. Side of my neck. You're itching. Anyways. But this could be a fucking couple. So, like, what I'm hearing is, is that you could be someone that's divine. You could be a divine masculine. You could be a divine feminine. Either or. 
this you was in a relationship with a karmic i feel like you've completed a karmic cycle you've moved on because i don't even feel the collective energy in here this motherfucker that you was in a relationship was a karmic you completed a karmic cycle with this person this person left you for a younger immature karmic or somebody that's just very immature somebody that um like i said you could have had a family with this person you could have had children with this person does not have to be this karmic met this other karmic on a dating site these two motherfuckers are pissed off because you're smart, you're intelligent, you're beautiful, you're handsome, and they're sending you the fucking evil eye. So they could be watching you on fucking social media or something like that. Let me kind of line these cards up real quick, you guys. Remember, you could be dealing with somebody that's an Aquarius or a Taurus. This person name could start with an H. I hope everybody is doing well. I'm having a wonderful day. God is so good, y'all. Let's see. Let me see. Let me light some more sage. And if y'all hear my babies babbling in the background, my, I have a little eight-month-old, and she, like, babbles. She in there, like, <laughs> talk. she talks to the cartoons. So, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, tell me more about this situation, please. Do you want me to use this deck spirit is saying no? I need to use I need to use I guess this deck. I don't know. Y'all spirit be having me like all over the place sometimes. I be like, what y'all want me to do? So yeah, tell me about Tell me more about this situation. Yeah, exactly. This motherfucker was a karmic to you. This person was very evil, manipulative, and nasty. This person always may have tried to one-up you, always tried to get over on you. Yeah. This person tried to work with other people to sabotage you. So there could have been several people working in cahoots. Yeah, but I, like I said, I don't see your energy out here. You've moved on. You've sailed on. Yeah, this person wanted you heartbroken. This person wanted you heartbroken and stuck. They didn't want you to move on. They didn't want you to sell on the karma waters. They didn't want you to move forward. Yeah, this person wanted to continue to do black magic and do spell work on you. But Spirit, like, I really don't want to hear that. I mean, I ain't trying to be rude, Spirit. Yeah, this person always one up you. Like, I still, I'm still, I'm still starting to get the same ass, repetitive ass storylines, like, Dang, y'all see that? Like, my fucking light just flickered. Like, I don't know if y'all seen that. Somebody don't want me to get this message out. I'm hearing that song by Keith Sweat. Nobody. And who can do you all night long? Nobody, baby. So this, feel like, this person feels like, can't nobody do you like them? On, on, on and on, no. Mm. Now I want the night for me and you. So come here, baby, and let me do it to you. I'm seeing some y'all, but don't be afraid, cause I won't buy. I promise to give it to you just the way you like. And who can love you like me? Who can give you what you need? Yeah, thank you, Spirit. All right, y'all, look. So all of this, this motherfucker that you was in a relationship that that, that, that met another karmic on a dating site, I feel like you've completed a karmic cycle with this person. So you know what the divine did? The divine didn't bless you with an emperor. Somebody that love you. I feel like I, I feel like I'm starting to pick up on a fucking that empress reading that I got with fucking karmic and Taurus. Don't have to be collective. But whoever this emperor is, this motherfucker don't play about you at all. And I feel like this is this ex-karmic karma for like, I feel like this person always tried to one-up you walking devil energy 
this person thought that they could get another you. You can't, excuse me, you can't get another emperor or a empress. I mean, you can, but I mean, they're rare. It's not too many of us out here. You know what I'm saying? But like this person's karma is having to walk, watch you. Y'all can hear my dryer. I always be washing y'all something. But this person thought that, I, I'm hearing, I'm, excuse me, this person karma is having to watch you walk off with the love of your life. I feel like this person is watching you from afar. This person really, really fucking misses you. This person wishes that they would have treated you better. My light keep flicking. What the hell? What the hell? Did y'all just see that? That shit creeping me the fuck out. Angel number 1036 could be significant. Why the fuck do my light keep flickering? That's weird. My light has never done that, y'all. My light ain't never done that. And my bills is paid. I, I, I don't know what they flicking for. That got me kind of nervous. Well, yeah, motherfuckers mad because you in the nine of pentacles. Shit, you in love. You happy. Not worried about this motherfucker. Yeah, focusing on yourself. Focusing on your abundant. Working hard. Yeah, mad. This person mad because they fucking juggled you. Yeah, was in this childish ass energy and shit. Trying to keep you stuck. Trying to get you wrapped up into fucking bullshit. Yeah. Knowing that you were somebody very loving. Knowing that they could have had a ten of pentacles with you. But this motherfucker wanted to be a fucking devil to you. Collective. This could, You could be dealing with a fucking Capricorn. But how does this person feel about you? That's what I want to know. Well look. Thank you spirit. This person is saying that you're my empress. I want you to come back. I love you. Now I'm starting to get a fucking channeling. I love you. I'm going through karma. I'm going through pain for fucking leaving you for a fucking karmic, a fake bitch. I feel like some this person wants to keep up with the Joneses. This person that they left you for could have portrayed themselves to be like a boss. Somebody that had their shit together. But I'm hearing like this person could have portrayed themselves to be like a boss. Or somebody they had that had their fucking shit together. Or whatever but really they don't like they got families that's helping the family that's helping them or something like that okay for example y'all ever met and i'm not a hater i'm not a hater at all y'all but i i know i've encountered people in my life other women and anything you know that like me and i'm not afraid to speak about me i don't have anything to hide but i ain't gonna tell all my business on here but i can just give my use myself a little brief of myself for an example me personally i was never one of those young ladies growing up that had like a support system i didn't have two loving parents so everything that i've had to experience and i haven't endured i've had to get it out the mud i had to stand on my own too you know so that's like like a lot of men be fucking intimidated by me because i don't fucking need them if i got a hundred dollars if i got a hundred thousand or if i got ten dollars i'm gonna make some shake because i'm i'm me you know and i feel like whoever this karmic was this motherfucker um um was jealous of that so you could be somebody like me. So this person could have been very fucking jealous of your strength, your courage, your ambition. Yeah, so this person could have tried to walk off in your energy. But that's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is, is that some of these women out here who have had like support systems or men too. Some of these people out here have had a push started life, which is really the right thing to do because I have children and, and as a parent, I would want my children to have a good push start in life. But some people get on a high horse and they think that they're better than the others that, you know, and they think people are beneath them. And so they become fake. And act like they try to keep up with the Joneses and act like they better than motherfuckers. But you ain't never been through nothing. You ain't never experienced real hardships because you've always had someone to hold your hand. So I feel like this karmic that this this person is going through karma. But this karmic that they left you for is a baby. And I'm not talking about just a baby in age. Or I'm talking about as a baby in life. This person is probably like a queen of wands, king of wands. This motherfucker is not you. This motherfucker is not an empress. This motherfucker is not an emperor. This person has not elevated. This person has not experienced anything yet. And so now it's it's this this person lack understanding. So I feel like <laughs> oh spirit. I feel like you could have been an empress or an emperor. And I, that other energy that I seen, beautiful energy. Whoever y'all done moved on with, 14.44 on the clock, whoever y'all done moved on with, y'all happy. That's, that's not even on the radar here. 
these two motherfuckers is giving y'all the evil eye though. But what I'm seeing is, is that fucking, you could have been an empress. Excuse me. That flew out the devil. Something more about that. But yeah, you could have been an empress or an emperor that was real understanding. This karmic, this ex-karmic you was with. They could have lacked understanding, but I feel like when they lacked understanding in y'all relationship, it was on purpose. They didn't want to grow up. They didn't want to change. They didn't want to mature. Now, this karmic that you, your ex karmic that you were with, now this motherfucker is with somebody that really don't understand. And this person is not understanding because they don't want to. This person is a fucking, like, kid. Like, I'm not going to say kid as an age. This person has not elevated. This person is not mature. This person has not been through anything. It's like talking to a brick wall when you arguing with somebody who 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 who's not mature in in certain areas i feel like this could have been an older man going through a midlife crisis that left you for a younger female a, a baby does not have to be or this could be an older woman that got with a younger man or something like that like i said this could be a you could be dealing with a taurus or aquarius that's what came out but what I'm seeing is this is this person's karma because I feel like not only is this karmic not understanding, don't understand shit, ain't never been through shit, trying to keep up. Because I feel like I'm hearing that this karmic may want this masculine, this karmic masculine to like, like, um, do a lot of luxurious things, take them out. This person may not know how to save. So this person may, may, this person could have like a really good career or have money, but this person does not know how to manage. This person may take their money and go shopping and go out to eat and go hang out with their friends. They don't know how to like go to the store when you get paid and pay your bills and buy groceries. You know, buy something, some food for the house, pay your bills. You know what I'm saying? We done all been there. You got your bills paid. You got food in the refrigerator. And then maybe next check I can go hang out with my friends. <laughs> but I feel like whoever this karmic is, that your ex-karmic left you for, they don't know how to do that. So I feel like, damn, I just seen a vision. I feel like I'm hearing like two motherfuckers in the house hungry. Ain't got nothing to fucking eat or something like that because this month I'm seeing two motherfuckers that don't know how to manage money right or something like that. Yeah, you just over here in the overflow of abundance. Why this motherfucker is stuck? You over here with your king of pentacles. Yeah, why this motherfucker is dealing with a childish ass female or a childish ass male that they met off a fucking dating site. Yeah, this is this could be they could have a uh, I'm seeing like a secret pregnancy or something like that. Yeah. And I feel like this person is trying to keep a secret from you. This person is trying to keep a secret. This ex-karmic from this from you, this empress or this emperor. They're trying to keep this a secret from you because they're wanting to come back come back towards you. But you're like, nah, uh-uh. I'm happy sitting over here in my justice. You 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 keep laying down in the bed that you that you made. I'm getting my justice. Okay. You could be dealing with a Libra collective. Yeah, they shouldn't have been trying to one up you, be nasty. But I feel like whoever you with, this motherfucker don't play about you. So this, 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 this person, this ex of yours, could be afraid to reach out or something like that. <sighs> yeah, this motherfucker is going through heavy fucking karma, heavy fucking karma for for betraying a empress or a emperor. Y'all, I be glad when I get some new energy. No disrespect, collective, but it just be like some of this shit be repetitive. I be like, Spirit, can you can you give me something else, please? Let me see. Is there anything else, Spirit, before I close this message out? I don't know why Spirit is telling me to pull pull from my deck again. Let's see. Let me, dang, my stage just be going out. I'm at 18 minutes, y'all. Let me hurry up and kind of close this out. Dang. Okay. Didn't dang smoke on my dang lips. Look, what I tell y'all. Y'all moving on. This person is really fucking depressed. Look, I'm not. Look, I can't make this up. This person is. You're moving on. This person is fucking hella depressed watching you. This person is surrounded by snakes. This person was a fucking snake to you. And this person, the same people or person that they left you for, which I think is just a particular person, person is a fucking snake. This person is extremely bored with this person that they're with. This person is watching you because you could be a twin flame of their, you could be their divine counterpart. And this person is saying, 
we're just not good for one another. But I feel like this person is not saying they're just not good for you. This is what they're trying to tell. Oh, so this person could be dealing with like a crazy fucking karmic or something like that. This person, so your 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 ex karmic masculine or feminine could be telling this karmic, look, I don't think we good for each other. You not smart enough for me. You're controlling. You like drama. I don't want to keep going through this fucking karma. You, 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 you evil. I feel, <laughs> I feel like this fucking karmic could have put a spell, put a spell on this fucking male hoe. This motherfucker that had a big ass ego. 18. So this person that they left you for could have been 18, 21. Ooh, I can't make this motherfucking shit up. This motherfucking person could have been a fucking Jezebel who lied and fucking tried to wear a fucking facade and really ain't got no money. Broke, no funds. No, 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 no money. No, 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 no anything in the bank. A, a person that's a fucking sex addict. Somebody that's scorned from their fucking past relationships or childhood or something. Yeah, a, this child molester. So this person could have been touched as a child. This karmic could have been touched as a child molested. Or this could have been your person. Or this person might be a, a sick person that touches children. Yeah, and this could be like a secret. Yeah yeah and there's heavy gossip going on in the community with this like i can't make this shit up look these cards are not fucking organized these my homemade cards and i got energy on them yeah look 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 wait a minute well i just missed it hold on hold on i just seen it y'all because I, I can hear the song in my head this motherfucking damn is it not meant for me to they well they hating on your ass and spirit is giving you clarity to this situation. I just look. There you go, spirit. I'm like, dang, y'all don't want me to sing the song. But now, <laughs> I'm hearing that song. This person is, man, this person is saying, I don't want to be a player no more. Finally found someone I can spend my life for. Whatever the words is. But this motherfucker, how you, what you mean you finally found someone? You didn't know what you had when you had it? You know, they say you miss what you had when it's gone. You the one was fucking unloyal. This person could be 28. You the one was out here being a dog and a cheater and freaky and shit. Fucking, I'm, I'm hearing shopping spree so this motherfucker could have um tried to keep up with the joneses this person could have went to this younger person because they thought that they were better than you they thought this person had more than you this person could have been a person that like bought them lavish things or vice versa this person thought that they could have had a better life could have attracted more abundance with this this karmic but yeah now the truth is starting to come out this person could be 35 this person feels like you are my angel. You, this, you're this, like I said, you are a divine masculine or a divine femi feminine. You're so used, you're so different from what I'm used to. Yeah, this person knew that you were one of a kind. This person knew that they were supposed to be with you. Excuse me, but this person wanted more. This person chose financial uh, things over, 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 over true love. And now they stuck with a karmic feminine and a karmic masculine or a karmic masculine fucking going through fucking spiritual warfare. Yeah. So somebody could be a thief in this situation. So this karmic that they could have left you for could steal or this person could steal or something like that. I'm seeing like somebody could have stole something at an event. So that could have been like a family barbecue or something like that. This person could be the age of 32. This person could be 27. So that could have been like a... Uh... Hold on one second. Y'all motherfuckers... Motherfuckers don't be want me to get messages out and shit. But anyways, y'all, this person, this person hates you. I feel like this person hates you because they don't hate you because they don't love you. This person hates you because, look, love. This person is very much in love with you, but this person hates you because you've moved on. Yeah, this person could have prayed for somebody like you. This person could have prayed for somebody like you, and they ruined it when they got the opportunity. I feel like this person was not ready. Yeah, because it said twin flame earlier. This person was not ready because they was in this energy, money over bitches. Yeah, they, was, they wanted money, fame, fortune. Yeah, 
this person is like asking you, are you really my divine feminine? Are you really my divine masculine? I wasn't ready for you. I was a hoe. I was a dog. I was a cheater. I wasn't trying to do this shit. I was a player. But now I don't want to be a play player no more. But this person lacks accountability. This person will never own up. This person has never apologized to you, maybe. This person may be not very apologetic. This person will not own up to what the fuck shit. Look, I need you back in my life. I can't make this shit up, but this person was a trickster. This person thinks you're very sexy, male or female. Look, this person wants to sleep with you talking about bend over now. This person's name could start with a B D. This person's name could be Derek, Devin, Damon, I'm hearing. You hurt me. Yeah, I feel like this person likes to play fucking victim. They like to be in a very vindictive uh, 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 energy. This person, not only is this person jealous of you, this fucking karmic is jealous of you. I feel like these people, these this couple, this karmic couple is doing fucking spell work. This person says, I still remember what you had on that day. So you guys could have went on an outing or something before you called. I'm hearing like called it quits before you called it quits. And this person is saying, you're very beautiful. This person is saying, I like I said, this person is saying, I wish you, I wish I met you later in life because I had a big fucking ego. I didn't know that you were like a fucking twin or something like that. I didn't know. This person thinks you got a fat ass. A, a fat ass <laughs> oh i'm getting tongue twisted yeah this person think you got a beautiful body this person name could start with a c i'm hearing this person karmic could start, name could start with a k this person knows that you're someone that's very enlightened yeah yeah this person is majorly depressed and stuck on you Look, it says, are you really moving on this time hell the fuck yeah you are because you're an emperor or an empress yeah and you could be dealing with a Pisces. Yeah. All right, you guys. My name is the Comedic Medium Providence. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, please like, subscribe, and share. If you would like to donate to my channel, my cash app is in the description box. And if you would like to email me, my email is in the description box. Thank you for watching my channel. Let's hit the like button. Please like, subscribe, and share. And goodbye.